Sharia and Islamic law, myths and realities. For many in the West today, Sharia is a word that evokes fear. Fear of a medieval legal system that issues draconian、uh, punishments. Fear of relegation of the women and religious minorities to second class citizenship. Fear of Muslims living as、uh, separate communities who refuse to integrate with the rest of society and fear that Muslims will seek to implement Sharia in the West. These fears are、uh, reinforced by the sensational media he- headlines, interest group, lobbies, and politicians who believe in and warn of a clash of civilizations between Islam and the West. Yet, Opinion polls and lived realities, both in Muslim majority countries and in the West, paint a, paint a more complex picture of Islam and what Sharia means to Muslims and the buried laws. Buried laws Muslims want it to play in the public sphere. Many Muslims maintain that observing Sharia is central to Islam and to their lives. They see Sharia as upholding the value of good governance, representative government, the public interest, social justice, human freedoms and rights, and individual accountability.、Hmm. These conflicting visions of the Sharia as a threat versus a source of guidance and protection raise major questions about the Sharia myths and the Sharia li- li- realities that Chapter 1 discusses. Why is so much fear associated with Sharia? Is it very different from the other religious laws found in the Judaism, Christianity, and other faiths? Do, mu- do Muslims in the United States and Europe want to replace Western laws with the Sharia? Could Sharia ever be implemented in the West? Does Sharia pose a threat to Western values?